those that all, and I can say all of our employees do have approved work permits. So I think they, they want to pass with a formality and um, both immigration and labor departments are fully aware of, um, you know, how we have been doing and what we have been doing. So, and, and I want to say that I do believe that the minister himself might not have that data, but both the labor commissioner as well as the the senior officer in immigration, along with Ms. Marina, are fully aware because um, I personally deal with those issues on behalf of Santander. So when I say that, I know that one, it's not 300, it's not by a long shot. Um, I know that they all have gotten approved work permits from the Labor of, from the Ministry of Labor, sorry. We made a, a, a case to the Ministry of Labor saying that our greatest challenge was finding uh, the level of um, welders. And in so doing, we were granted the permission to bring the, the, the welders that we required to get the job done. I will say to you that our workforce, the, the number of employees that we have here at Sandaner, well over 80% of them are actually Belizean. We have secured work permits for all the, the, the non-nationals prior to the Christmas break because we had closed off on the 19th of December, so we had to renew everybody's paperwork. And that was done up until the 23rd of December. So these guys that were coming in specifically for Santander, and as I said, um, not even 100, much less 300 are direct Santander.